Well, finally, one debate that has been settled, the one over where the popular Indian sweet Rasgulla originated. Well, two friendly neighboring states, West Bengal and Odisha, locked horns, taking claim that now it looks like West Bengal has been granted the GI or the geographical indication status. And that certainly means a sweet victory for Bengalis. This is what's called sweet victory, quite literally. West Bengal has won a bitter battle with neighbor Orisha over the soft and spongy sweet Roshagulla. The Geographical Indications Registry has announced the signature sweet originated in Bengal. The GI tag victory was so big, even the West Bengal Chief Minister enthusiastically tweeted from London while on an official trip. While in other parts of India, people celebrate all good occasions and all good festivals with sweets. But in Bengal, there is this particular sweet rasagolla. But the Oriyas are not giving up just yet. After all, they say there's scientific evidence that the rasagolla existed in the state 600 years ago. If the sweet existed hundreds of years ago, when it is when it is decided and accepted, then we have to accept it. We are we are telling it is from Odisha only. Uh -huh. So we will fight for that again. It will go to the court. It's perhaps it is in the court. Why are Bengal and Orisha fighting now? Well, confectioners hope the GI tag and bragging rights will translate into good business for them. They are spending time and money researching ways to increase the shelf life of the sweet. Rasgulla has got a very short shelf life which cannot be preserved. So we have um, experimented with it and we have come out with the can which will stay good for up to six months. On that sweet note, Bengal is celebrating some more with what else but the Rasgulla. Bureau report, we on.